And Boyden is a 2023 preseason Player of the Year candidate, coming off of a season in which he scored 133 points on 86 goals and 47 assists. He's a lethal finisher and a really dangerous off-ball player. But if you haven't pegged as just an off-ball guy, this breakdown is just the thing that you need to see. And while I do have plenty of those dodging type of clips, I first want to start with a few off-ball pieces and him working as a finisher. The first one is going to be him starting inside. They're going to slide right off of him. And as you can see, they're going to really kind of show their, tilt their hand. This show is really going to uh, open things up in there. And then now he's going to catch it, fake real, real quick around the world, and then finishes back to the near pipe on a shovel. So really slick stuff there. And then again, we're just going to let a few of these finishing type clips uh, roll here. And... Um, Again, this time he's working inside, he's going to find a little seam, and then turns that into a, fin a, a catch and finish. And again, finds a little seam there, great patience inside, and then a quick twister finish to go ahead and polish that thing off. Again, this time he's going to be working on the right pipe, and this time he's going to catch it and doesn't really have much of an angle. And again, that patience and kind of composure as a finisher is going to show here. So that little subtle dip right there kind of t makes the defender pay for wave and stick, and then he's able to increase his angle on it. And then again, we're going to he's going to catch it in a very similar spot, and this time instead of finishing it with his feet stationary and leaning, he's going to throw a little hitch, quick hitch, and then now he comes back up the field and shoots it around the defender. So really slick stuff there. Again, nice job um, kind of showing the two different options there. When you catch that on the pipe, you want to get to a spot where you have more angle, whether it's to the front of the cage or up the hash, and there you get both. And then now we're going to get another really good kind of comparison clips where we got a dodge happening over on that far wing. He's working on the backside, catches it for a quick step down. And then now we get later in the same game, we get a similar spot on the field where the ball is at, uh, where the dodge is occurring. Again, on the backside, he's going to catch it. Big wind up, quick hitch, and now he's going to go by it underneath and finishes with low angle. So really slick finish, but all of setting that up uh, was really good and has a lot to do with his off-ball movement and his ability to catch and finish in difficult spots, whether it's great composure or patience, whatever it is that sets him up for success. And now we're going to get into some dodging clips here. This time we're working on a short stick, and he's going to be nice and patient works and gets back to the middle where he has plenty of shooting angle and plenty of uh, space and, and finishes it off this time is a little less traditional except he's going to go out of pole here we're going to work up to our left hand and then roll over our left shoulder and become a uh, shooter over behind the back and the goal is a little out of position here a little outside of the goal which is going to help but he really buries that thing in the bottom corner on the far pipe so really nice clip there again we get a dodge over here on the wing the initiating contact, leaning, and then that slick finishing ability, not just off of the catch, but off of the dodge there. And he was on another level this NESCAC weekend, so we get a lot of these clips here against Wesley and Bowden. And uh, again, we're going to be attaching a short stick. He's going to do this with you know, a ton of patience, reading the defenders, reading the off-ball pieces, fights to the middle, and then once he gets there, he's such a high percentage shooter that you know that thing's ended up in the back of the cage. Here again, we're dodging on that high corner. This time we're going out of pole. Gets a step on him, and he does a really good job tucking that stick, keeping it nice and tight in front of him so that he's going to have plenty of space to finish. Again, we're going to be work to get it unassisted here. And the theme here, low angle finish, right? He's just such a savvy finisher, whether it's off the catch or the dodge, that if he's able to drive his defender to tight spaces to close to the goal or to 5-5, five and five, he's going to be able to make you pay. And then he likes dodging on that high corner, attacking the middle of the field. And in this instance, he uses a little bit of a twister finish to make sure that thing ends up in the back of the net. And so that's going to do it for Jack's breakdown here. Again, he's coming off of a season in which he had 133 points on 86 goals and 47 assists. But perhaps the most impressive stat is his shooting percentage. Up over 44% as an actual shooter and up over 70% as a shots on goal shooter. So really impressive numbers there in general. But again, his ability to w hit you as an off ball uh, piece and a finisher is absolutely um, you know a, a benefit of his game. But if you have him pegged as just an off ball piece, he's certainly going to make you pay as a dodger when he has the opportunity. Yeah.